Okay guys, it is 10 to 3. The winds have died down a bit. We looked and it said we were, we're the eyes coming. So according to Dennis, it's moving out. Hello again everyone. It is 7.50. Okay guys, it is 10 to 3. The winds have died down a bit. We looked and it said we were, we were the eyes coming. But there's, there was a gap in the middle of the eye, which was giving us a little bit of a reprieve on the winds. It's still windy, but it's not high winds. Apparently our highest winds are gonna come around um, 7 a.m. between 6 and 8 6 and 8 um so yeah we're just ash and maddie were asleep on the couch i cannot sleep i'm just sitting there my stomach's churning and churning and churning and i'm running up and down to it. so i'm just like i may as well just come sitting here because it's not as loud right now so i don't mind sitting next to the windows um but yeah luna is in ashley's bathroom in between the bath and the toilet, she won't come out. She was laying against the laundry room door and then she was laying against Ashley's bedroom door. And when I went into the loo at one point, she followed me in and she won't come out. And I don't wanna keep walking past these guys. I've got my door open right now, but I don't wanna keep walking past and wake Maddie. So this will be the beginning of Thursday's vlog, so happy Thursday. It's been terrible for a lot of people in Florida, and I'm not gonna lie, it's been scary here, the winds, loud, and the rain pelting against the house, and the stupid Christmas lights are still up from whatever tenant put them up, and they're quite big, and they just keep banging against the house, which makes you more nervous. So I'm going to tell them again afterwards. We need them taken down. I am not climbing up a ladder to take down lights from somebody else. And I've asked them three times now. And I'm now I'm going to demand. Because they just keep banging against the house. And they make a terrible noise. Anyway. I need to put some uh, something over my legs because I'm cold. And I've got shorts on. But I've been watching other people's updates, seeing how everyone else is doing. There's a lot of lives. I can't keep watching the hurricane <coughs> footage. I'm getting my updates on the phone. We're complying. We're doing everything we're supposed to do. We're not leaving or going anywhere. So I was like, that desk looks familiar. Yeah, it's mine. <laughs> Came up in the playlist. Anyway, guys, we'll give you another update in a little bit, but right now it's a bit on the calm side. We're not finished yet because it hasn't even hit us yet, but we're a little on the calm side. So according to Dennis, it's moving out. Um, we'll still be getting Gus up there for a little while. It is now four. 18 and you can hear the rain is back don't know if you can hear it. it's hitting against the window i need to try and lay down for a little bit i haven't even gotten into bed luna's still in the bathroom ash and maddie are still sleeping hopefully Ash was waking up quite a bit, I don't know. Hopefully she's still asleep. Hello again, everyone. It is 7.50. We're good. We made it through. Got a bit hairy again after four. Winds picked up and the rain was beating against the windows. You can see there's just a lot of stuff falling out of the tree, but nothing, no damage. No water, nothing. We are so lucky. And we kept our power. A lot of people did not fare as well. I know Katie lost her power very early. Jules lost her power. Um, 
for thousands and thousands and thousands without power. So yeah, we are very, very lucky. Now we've gone through this one, I feel like we can take anything because they were saying that, you know, this is one of the worst ones in a hundred years. So I want to get coffee, but this they're, they're asleep. Ashley was awake. She woke up around 20 past four. We were chatting. Um, and then I did end up going to bed for a couple of hours. So I feel good about that. But yeah, <coughs> I just want to thank everybody that's been in touch with us, talking to us. There was a few of us that live here that were texting each other throughout the whole thing. So that was really, really nice just to have that support. And, you know, you know you're not alone because it's scary. When it's dark, it's scary. I know Jack, they lost power. Um, so... They lost power quite early as well. So yeah, so grateful. So grateful. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go and do everything I do in the mornings with the computers. Check different things, this, that and the other. And then when I hear some noise, I will go make a coffee. I don't want to wake anyone up because it was quite a night. <laughs> quite a night. Luna is still in Ashley's bathroom. So she'll come out once it stops raining and stuff. Like I said, it's breezy now, but nothing. This Dennis Phillips, yeah. I followed him and watched everything he had to say. As you can see, all good here. to let these dry out and take them back in, put them in the garage. So we owe Jane a huge, and Jeremy a huge thank you for allowing us to have sand because by the time we knew about sandbags and stuff, the lines were hours and hours long. And just like a normal rainy Florida morning. And I think the next few days are all full of sunshine, so. I can't wait to see those beautiful blue skies again. So yesterday I didn't really eat a lot, so look at the size of this croissant. I'm just having a croissant with some peanut butter and my first coffee of the day because I didn't want to wake Ash off. Not that she was fully asleep, but she was dozing, so. Okay guys, this is as good as it gets for today. <laughs> I am absolutely shattered, Ashley's shattered. Maddie's shattered. It was a long night and um, with nerves on top, it definitely takes a toll. So Luna's shattered too. She's uh, over on the couch fast asleep. But uh, yeah, today's going to be one of those days where we just take it easy. I have a shepherd's pie to throw in the oven, um, which we'll do later. And then just chill out, chill out. Um, we both feel like we've been out all night because, you know, you're up and down, you're worrying, you're at the windows, you're listening at every sound, so. But, as you all know, we made it through, we're good. Ashley said we did lose power for a little bit, so it must have been one of the times when I just got into bed last night. I put the covers over my head at one point because it got really loud again after I stopped videoing. Um, and Ash said everything went green through the windows and a transformer was hit. And we lost power for a little bit and then it came back on. Then it happened a second time um, and then it came back on. So that's why I was sitting there going, why am I resetting things today? Like, what's going on? We didn't lose power. But apparently we did and I missed that little bit. So thankfully I missed that little bit. <laughs> but yeah. <coughs> I put the guys on every other again for the lawns. So the lawns again. Here we go again. The grass. Um, so they won't be coming and cleaning this up, but maybe I'll invest in a rake and rake it up myself at some point. Right now, I can't bother to do anything. It's so soggy and wet. It's still raining on and off. We're still under high winds until I think it said eight o'clock tonight. They are picking up a little bit, but we've got this. <laughs> we've got this. Apparently that next hurricane that's coming through Wednesday was apparently on the same path, but now it's going up to Texas. So all my friends in Texas, be safe. 
Um, but yeah, again, I just want to thank everybody for your advice and keeping us calm and everything you said. It's nice to to know that you're out there and some of you have been through enough of them that you had sound advice. All right, guys, I'm going to love and leave you because I, <laughs> I just want to go. I've got to finish my coffee. I still haven't finished my coffee. I also was keeping in touch with Rosemary from a tribe called Henry. Um, we exchanged numbers last night and we were like texting each other and checking in on each other. They too lost power. Um, they still don't have power, but they're fine. Um, the Adventure Lees, the, I think they lost power. I don't know if they got theirs back, but they're fine. So it really goes to show when things like this happen, how the YouTube community band together. There's so many people down here now that I know from YouTube channels that we've kind of formed a little group, so it's nice. I'm gonna lay down for a little bit. My eyes are closing. I'm sitting in somebody's live stream and I'm nodding off. So I'm gonna lay down, so I'm gonna close these because I don't wanna see anything, hear anything. I think Ash may be snoozing and Maddie. Luna definitely is. So I'm gonna join them. Do the same. We're having a chill moment, aren't we? I did sleep for about an hour. Not enough, but enough. <laughs> enough for now. I'm going to put the shepherd's pie in in a little while because it takes about an hour and a half because it's a big one from Costco. Just put some drops in Miss Luna's ears because she's having a fit with her ear. Now, I took Luna out. It's very windy still. So I don't know whether just to wait to put the furniture back out because we're still under a wind advisory and with the ground being so soggy and everything, but... I get to the point now where I said to Ash, I'm getting antsy. I just want everything out of the living room so we can tidy up. But, um, you know, we got the extra thing. Even though she didn't sleep in there last night, she was not happy with it. Furniture in the kitchen, the table from the backyard. In I know, Nanny's waffling. So just to tidy it up, maybe just wait till tomorrow morning and everything is less windy and it's supposed to be a beautiful sunny day. And then I can sweep the paths when everything's dry. There's a lot of debris on the grass out front. Not complaining, because we're very lucky, but yeah. Hi guys, well, it seems everyone's getting their power back, that I know anyway, um, which is good news. I am going to end the vlog, because I'm not going to... I'm so tired. And if I can stay awake to watch Big Brother, fantastic. If not, I don't. But um, I don't want to have to worry about editing this at 11 o'clock tonight. It's 7.25 right now. Ash is just watching um, Hocus Pocus. I was just playing with Maddie for half an hour. Um, and now I think she's getting tired again. So Luna's back in here. Ash just took her out and she went mental trying to go after a little dog, didn't you? You wanted to play. I almost pulled Ash over. You're too strong. It's still raining. Um... Is it still windy, Ash? A little bit, yeah. Yeah, a little bit windy. So um, we've still got the sandbags out here. We're just going to pull them all in when they dry off and get rid of them on Tuesday with bulk. I think we can do that. But yeah, that's it, guys. So that's been our Thursday in a nutshell. <laughs> um, heavy eyes. I've been in a few streams today. Um, there was a guy going around um the animal resort i forget the name of it i'm not very good with names um i'm just showing the debris there and the cleanup and the dance parties and everybody just being together um riding this thing out so yeah so on that note <coughs> i hope you've all had a brilliant brilliant thursday whatever it is you did today I hope it was a good one and we'll definitely see you tomorrow. Take care, guys. Stay safe. And if you haven't, please subscribe.